XYZ Printing is one of the machine manufacturers that provide the most comprehensive range of additive manufacturing technologies in the industry. They've developed 3D printers for makers, for professional 3D printers, and they recently launched a series of industrial 3D printers to target more industrial companies that actually adopt AM technologies for end production. The last time we spoke to Fernando was in 2019, and today at Firm Next 2021, we wanted to catch up with Fernando and discover the latest development of the company in their field of activity. So good morning, Fernando. Good morning, Katie. How are you doing? Fine, what about you? Okay, yeah, thanks, fine. So it's been a long time we didn't talk to each other. So tell me, how has XYZ printing evolved since 2019? Okay, well, uh, 2019 we were doing our first steps in industry segment and definitely in these two years yeah. we take it to cook and to prepare and to aggressively enter more uh, into industrial. Now we yeah. have widely more offer, okay. not only machines but also all the ecosystem around the machine, yeah. materials, software applications, services, so all the cover around, not only the machine anymore. Well, that's good. And uh, I've heard that you've actually unveiled a new 3D printer today at Firmnex. But first of all, how long does it take to develop an industrial 3D printer? Okay, um, it took us quite a few years, five years more or less, to launch our first uh, uh, machine on SLX, for example. Mm -hmm. uh, it only took us two years to improve and launch a uh, upgrade version. Uh, so basically, once you have already the technology and the knowledge and the know-how, then you can easily uh, evolve or expand. I All think right. the first steps are the ones that take longer time and investment. All right, I see. And tell us more then about this 3D printer. Is it this one? Uh, well, not exactly this one, but very similar to this one. Uh, right. Basically, uh, it, we double the capacity, so we come from previously 30 watts CO2 laser, now we offer 60 watts CO2 laser. Okay. We expand the building chamber, so increasing the flexibility in regarding of printing big SLS parts. But now can, uh, the, the production runs are way faster because of the builder uh, size is bigger. Right. The CO2 laser also offers faster scanning speed. Um, also increasing the temperature, which means you can sinter together uh, polyamines that before were out of range and now you can work with them, such as PA6, all the families of PA6 or polypropylene and several different technical uh, polyamines. Before we couldn't reach them, but now they are all in the portfolio. So our offering regarding our materials are pretty wide, so it means the business can reach more verticals, can reach yeah. more applications and more uses. Oh yeah, and I was going to talk about material because I've seen that actually BASF is the materials producer, the producer that supports the development of that machine. So what are the different materials that the machine can process? Okay, in our case, uh, we wanted to offer, we have a premium offer, we wanted to offer premium solutions. Uh -huh. And that's why we partner with premium brands regarding the chemical industry. Mm -hmm. BSF is a leading uh, chemical company in regarding of polyamines. Um, they offer super exceptional mechanical properties yeah. and fairly decent uh, uh, recycle rates. Um, we are offering all the variety families of PA11s, PA11 carbon fiber, uh, polypropylene, TPU, uh, PA6, uh, PA6 with microfibers, etc. So we are all the complete, uh, the majority of the technical polyamides we cover. Now mm -hmm. thanks with our alliance with BSF. Well, that's good. And what about applications? Well, uh, for example, now we are entering very aggressively in automotive industry, yeah. uh, aerospace, aeronautics. Uh, we cover, of course, uh, we are fairly popular in industrial, uh, general industrial purposes for mechanical parts, mm -hmm. uh, enclosures, uh, etc. So we have quite several applications in the in many verticals, but those are just to name few. All right, perfect. Anything else uh, we should know for 2022? Uh, well, uh, yes, indeed. We had, let's say, one year, uh, everybody was well in lockdown, right? So yeah, now we are right. opening and uh, we are launching and we are, uh, but mainly 
we are focusing on SLS, which is one yeah. of our markets that are giving us um, the best um, um, uh, yeah, market. And we are going to keep our bet on SLS. We are going to expand the family, expand the services, expand the materials, and expand the alliances around. And at the end, the target is to offer affordability, easy of useness, and potential. And that's the, yeah, our, core, our core business. That's cool. Thank you very much, Fernando, for your time. Thank you, Katie. Pleasure. Have a nice day.